Surgeons are humans, and like all humans, they make mistakes. And making mistakes in the surgical field can unfortunately lead to fatalities. So the importance of surgical training is paramount. Once the pandemic hit, master classes and surgical training classes halted and came to a stop. We found that we could help these trainees improve their training by sending our products remotely to allow them to practice surgical training anytime, anywhere. About 10 years ago, my father-in-law was involved in a traffic accident, and later he has died because of the medical errors. What I think I can do is try to help the surgeon to improve his skills. So we started the Oglag company. It is unbelievable. In 2018, I found that my niece has a tumor between the pancreas and the spleen. It is quite tricky to remove the tumor. We print the models for the surgeon, and he liked it very much because the model is soft and can simulate the process so that the surgery is very successful. I was introduced to organ-like because they came up to the Highlands and Islands and it immediately became apparent that the, they had a product that met our needs and could simulate surgical procedures and train. This has become particularly important during the pandemic where access to training has been really curtailed. So having organ-like material has been fantastic. And actually, the COVID-19 pandemic has proved that there's a great opportunity in a market for these 3D printed, hyper-realistic mimic of human tissue. We can ask trainees to practice on this tissue and they can replicate operations that they would do in real life. The Sustainable Innovation Fund has helped us and Organlike get products out into the market. Surgical training occurs in all the countries around the world, so there's a real global need. And our products can travel. They're hydrogel based, and so they're easily transportable. During the pandemic, our manufacturing virtually came to a halt. The Sustainable Innovation Fund helped us ramp up our manufacturing to reach the medical schools in the UK and also outer reachers in Africa. With our partnership with the Royal College of Surgeons at Edinburgh, they have over 30,000 members in over 150 countries around the world. They've enabled our products to be reached on a global scale and we've helped countries like Malawi, Zimbabwe and Kenya and improved surgical training over there. Yesterday I got some pictures from our colleagues in Africa who had been using the surgical skills boxes. And these are fantastic pictures of Kenyan trainees using organ-like products to do surgical rehearsal, which is absolutely fantastic. The future of organ-like is really bright. In our team we have Professor Will Shu, who's a global leader in stem regeneration. And with his research and development, we can improve our products and models to then eventually be able to transplant them into the human body. By bringing 3D printed models to the market, we can reduce waiting times, we can help patients heal sooner and we can reduce organ donor rejection. Organ-like allows hospitals to make every patient a priority and it enables surgeons to be more confident at their work. <laughs>